Today's read aloud and must read aloud is From Dream Girl How One Girl's Courage Changed Music by Margarita Engel. Illustrated by Rafael Lopez. On an island of music in a city of drum beats, the drum dream girl dreamed. There she is, houses in the back on the seashore, dreaming away. Of pounding tall conga drums, tapping small bongo drums, and boom, boom, booming with long, loud sticks on big, round, silvery, moon, bright timbales. But everyone on the island of music in the city of drum beats believed that only boys should play drums. You can see all the boys are playing with the drums, laughing and smiling, and a very angry person is telling the little girl no. So the drum dream girl had to keep dreaming. Quiet, secret, drum beat, dreams. She's imagining herself as a beautiful mermaid drumming under the sea, the fishes are listening. At outdoor cafes that looked like gardens, she heard drums played by men, but when she closed her eyes, she could also hear her own imaginary music. She walked under wind wavy palm trees in a flower bright park she heard the whir of parrot wings, the clack of woodpecker beats, the dancing tap of her own footsteps, and the comforting pat of her own heartbeat. At carnivals, she listened to the rattling beat of towering dancers on stilts. And the dragon clang of costume drummers wearing huge masks. At home, her fingertips rolled out their own dreamy drum rhythm on tables and chairs. Sounds like she's always making music, always drumming somewhere. And even though Everyone kept reminding her that girls on the island of music had never played drums. There are her dreams, a drum in a birdcage stuck. The brave drum dream girl dared to play tall conga drums, small bongo drums, and big round silvery moon bright timbales. Her hands seemed to fly as they ripped, wrapped, and pounded all the rhythms of her drum dreams. She's imagining she's a butterfly and the flowers are drums and she's playing the drum beat of the flowers. Her big sisters were so excited that they invited her to join their new all-girl dance band. She has six sisters. But their father said only boys should play drums. Uh-oh. So the drum dream girl had to keep dreaming and drumming alone until finally her father offered to find a music teacher who could decide if her drums deserved to be heard there he is pulling her out of the tree and giving her hope that her dream might come true the drum dream girl's teacher was amazed. The girl knew so much 
but he taught her more and more and more and she practiced and she practiced and she practiced until the teacher agreed that she was ready to play her small bongo drums outdoors at a starlit cafe that looked like a garden where everyone who heard her dream bright music sang and danced and decided that girls should always be allowed to play drums and both girls and boys should feel free to dream. This is the true story of a little girl who was Chinese, African, and Cuban. And she, at the age of 10, broke the traditional taboo in Cuba of girls playing drums. Her name was Milo Castro Saldariga. And she performed with her older sisters in a band. The band was called Anacoana and it was Cuba's first all-girl dance band. I have links to their music in the description. <laughs> <laughs>